Mine, I love the city. I think I'm a city girl. I love the city. I love the city. I love the city. I'm always in the city. But my favorite places in Atlanta, oh, there's a lot. But mine, Atlantic Station is probably one of my favorite because throughout the holidays, they do all kinds of stuff downtown. Even like Christmas, you have ice skating. You have different activities and stuff like that. You have, but the Buckhead area, you know, you get to see a lot of celebrities who live, who do live there or who are visiting. Lenox Mall is my favorite. It's one of my favorites. Um, even Phillips. Phillips is nice. Phillips has Legoland in there. They have a lot of stuff that I like. The aquarium. the aquarium the dolphin show is my favorite so if you don't if you go to georgia and you don't go to the aquarium you're missing out on the dolphins yes. i love the dolphins there wait what people don't realize is that angel has been literally gone from home since the age of like 14 15 she moved to california for a while she came like she's went to Boca. she's been everywhere in the country basically like like everywhere by herself and she's left the country to go to like Russia Bulgaria so I mean Texas I I feel like wasn't that far away so I mean for Angel it's just she's done it for since she was little She's traveled by herself since she was little and went basically a lot of places. Athens is really small. And, you know, like in your town, you will have like a nice restaurant to where like, you know, you get dressed up and you go eat. But in Athens, a five-star restaurant is Applebee's. And I was like, this is going to rock my world because when I lived in all the is I was able to you know eat at nice places get food the nice grocery stores and then now you're in Athens to where like you have to drive 45 minutes to even see a Chick-fil-a or or Chipotle just anything but that's just me I love Chipotle I love Chick-fil-a I love I love food in general it's just it's different adapting to having a lot of different food options and my grocery store options. I literally call her every day, all day. Like my stress level has went from zero to a hundred because my kids are not home. And I got to realize they're not kids anymore. They're literally adults, like they're adults. And in my mind, I just thought they were going to be here forever. Like I was going to have them forever, but I don't. And it's kind of, it's, it, it's kind of weird and it's kind of hard to adjust my life when you live your life for your kids for so long. It's, it's hard. 